What's going on everyone? So I picked up the AirPods 2 yesterday and I immediately paired it with my iPhone XS running on the latest iOS update, I believe it's 12.2. And I started listening to my music with the app Amazon Music. Immediately within seconds, I experienced this issue that I'm gonna show you here and um, offer you a small fix that will temporarily get rid of this issue for you. So the issue I was having was whenever I played music, with Amazon Music and I pressed a button such as the sleep wake button, the song would either play faster, slower, or at a different pitch than normal. So I'm gonna go here and replicate that issue so you guys can take a listen. I'm going to cover the sensor to kind of replicate the AirPod being in my ear. All right, so it is connected and I'm gonna bring it up to the microphone so we can listen to it. So again, I'm just gonna press the sleep wake button a couple times so you guys can hear what I'm talking about. All right, so obviously that is not normal. So I've pretty much narrowed down the issue to being Amazon Music. I've tried the YouTube app and it works normally. The problem is only on Amazon Music. It is not that you have a defective pair of AirPods. So that's good news for me. And here I'm gonna show you a little workaround that you can do to bypass this issue until Amazon releases a fix. So all you've gotta do is go into the settings, locate Amazon Music, tap on it, and here where you see microphone, just disable that. Next, you want to force close the Amazon Music app, just like that. And when you load it again, it's gonna ask you to enable the microphone access. You're gonna hit cancel. And just like that, it should pretty much be fixed. So we're gonna do the same thing we did before. We're gonna replicate the AirPod being in my ear. And let's try it now. All right, so no problems there. Um, I hope you guys found this video helpful. I know for me it was extremely annoying and I was pretty much getting ready to return my AirPods, but this little workaround has fixed it and I'll just pretty much wait until Amazon releases a fix for it officially. If you found this video helpful, hit the like button, subscribe for more videos like this, and I'll see you in the next video.